This is amazing. The fact that I'm sitting here and I'm about to try in dresses at Kleinfeld is crazy. Can I wear one of these? Oh my gosh. Tammy's into it. I would really love to meet Randy. Who is Randy? What, babe? Oh my god. Who the f is Randy? Randy? He's like just oh, the most iconic You're wedding not... dress consultant ever. Hello, everyone. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> hi, hi. Oh my gosh. Hello. Yes. How you doing? Nice Hi, to meet you. Nice to meet you. Wonderful oh, <laughs> work with you. Yes. Randy's gonna steal her heart away from me. I can't trust her. Val, can I hug him? You can hug him. I know. Uh, yeah, Val, I've been wanting you? to do this. She's been waiting for this. Hi. Nice, Hi. nice to meet you. I can't believe it. We are gonna have a fun day. This is gonna be great. Do you guys dance? <laughs> do do dance? I dance? Oh. What? Uh, uh, wow. Wait, I'm not done. Oh, okay. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. Can I dance? Woo. He's got moves. Anyway, well, I'm sorry. We have to More talk about, about the appointment. Yes. Well, yes. So today I have my mom, Tammy, our family friend, Stacy, my future mother in law, Larissa, and my future sister in law, Pita. I know Hi. you. Hi. She was also on Dancing with the Stars, and Pita is married to Val's oldest brother, Max. I got to see them live out their fairy tale wedding, so it's kind of my turn, and I can't wait. Where are you getting married? So we're getting married in California. California is where we met, and kind of it means a lot to us. And so we're getting married at a resort really soon. When is really How soon? soon? Um, in How many two months? months. Two. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. another one okay. of those. We kind of did everything else and then just left the dress for the reception for last. We've been getting a lot of that lately. Constant. I am here to get my second dress, which is my reception dress. And for me, this is kind of my most important dress because I will be spending the most time in this. I really want to find the perfect one. For the reception, I want something really fun. I don't want anything poofy. Do we want Val hearing all this? Uh, yeah, this is like blasphemous for me to be oh, here. Okay. Oops. I'm just here to make sure that... <laughs> I don't know why I'm here. Really... Why am I here? Awesome. Bye. Thank you. Bye, Can baby. I keep the crown? Bye. Can I get the crown? No, <laughs> it's not for sale. Damn. <laughs> okay, so tell us what you're looking for in the dress. I want something super just extravagant and fun. Okay. I want more like detailing, but I want sleeves regardless. And it has so, to have please. sleeves? For Most my mom, them? yes. I just don't want it to be just too fleshy, too... Revealing. You know, I, I want the focus to be on her beautiful yeah. face. Yeah. So we need mom's approval. Yes. Okay. And I would like to stay 5,000. Okay. So I think we're ready. You're coming with us. Yes. yes. Ah! <laughs> oh my God. We'll see you soon. Every week I get these costumes that I get to wear. And the key word in that is costumes. Ooh. What do you th oh, can we get this in time? There's a lot of beating no, well, on this. It takes at least six to eight months to order a wedding dress. And I see that she's pulling a dress that has beading on it. That's gonna add extra time. I have to say, I'm worried about this. We'll be right back. Okay. I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna say, oh my God, Randy, we've gotta get a dress in two months. Right? With sleeves. The good news is, is Jenna is definitely a sample size. So I am going to have to find something right off the rack and beg for forgiveness. Let's see, what about like this? Do something like, this has got a sleeve. sleeve. The problem with sample dresses is, is that if we sell them now, we can't show them to another bride. But <laughs> we gotta make Jenna happy and we gotta get her a dress. Hello. Hi. Don't judge Hello. anything on the I'm hanger. Not, I'm not judging anything. So out of these, which one kind of excites you the most? Hmm. I do really like this one. Okay. okay. And then still my favorite is this one. Okay. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna keep looking. Okay. Let's get started with this one. Okay. I can feel that I am drawn to this Tony Ward dress. It's stunning. Oh my God, you look gorgeous. Wait, I kind of love it. <laughs> That's great. It's, it's my favorite. It's my first, but it's my favorite. <laughs> We have to keep okay, our fingers crossed that we can sell this. Okay, I'm gonna take these in the room. I have some more. Okay. What I'm nervous about right now is promise me that you won't be really super mad at me if they say we can't. I'll be a little <laughs> devastated, <laughs> but I won't hold it against you. Here she comes. Hi. All right, Jenna, oh. hop up on that pedestal. Stand up tall. Mom! Stand up tall. <laughs> How gorgeous is that? 
I love this one, just I feel like it's so different. And I love like the detailing and oh, how stark white Randy, it is. It's magnificent. I it's, just feel like it's fun. It's very special yeah. too. I have tried on dresses before, but this is the reception dress. You're gonna be dancing and sweating in it, having the time of your life in it. And so I really wanted the perfect dress. I love it. It's so unique. Yeah. Mom, this is a good neckline, right? Are you gonna be able to put like, you know? Oh, Are yes. you saying I don't have boobs? Maybe. <laughs> Mom! Really? <laughs> Miss really? conservative? Really? From you? It's looking a little bit um, uh, bunchy. Toughest critic. <sighs> yeah, look, it's big and let me, so Let me it's show slipping. you. Can I show him something? The waist needs to come up, like, it, it needs to come up a little. Right. That's beautiful, yeah. yeah. My mom is very special to me, and I really wanted her to love the dress. It was a great way to start the fitting. I love it. I think it's, I, like I love it. the high neck. Nice. You Beautiful, like it, right? Yeah. Okay, right, so this is the dress to beat. Everyone oh loves it. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Love okay, it. The only thing is, we don't have time to order this. We just pulled dresses oh. and we, we said we're going to go beg later if oh, she finds okay. one she loves. Yeah, so that's so, what we're doing. Okay, you ready? Yes. Okay. This dress is totally the one to beat. Be careful walking because this may be your dress. You don't want to rip it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Don't rip. I really hope that we can get this dress. Yay! Okay, look what I brought. This one, right, Jenna? Yes, okay, that so was it. Okay, so I should take out the rest of these, correct? Yeah. My mom had seen this dress. Look at this beautiful skirt. Oh. How pretty that is. So I really wanted to try it on and see if she loved it even more than the first dress. I think it's really pretty. I'm interested to see what it's my mom... It's very beautiful. Yeah. We are so ready. Rock, Rock and, and roll. roll. Here we go. Don't tell her. Let's see if she remembers. Okay. Oh, I love that. Wow, that is, isn't that gorgeous? I think I showed her that. What'd she say? She said I showed her that. I did, I showed okay. her that one. We can't pull the wool oh. over mama's eyes. That's why I picked it. I love How do you that. feel? I, I feel really pretty in this. How do you feel between this one and the first one? I think both are stunning and I feel amazing in both. So it's hard I'm torn. I want her to turn around. You picked it, Mom. I did. Isn't that gorgeous? Very beautiful. See, Mama knows best. <laughs> <laughs> that is exquisite. I love it. That's what do beautiful. You think? I feel more unique and like myself, I think, in the first one. So, Larissa, what do you think? Number one or this one? You like this really? one? Really? Wow. <laughs> My mom loves it. Stacy loves it. Thal's mom loves it. I'm like, oh gosh, do they like this one better? I feel like I need to put the other one on, yeah, maybe. That's what I yes. think. This was a good choice. Thank you. Yes. But I usually never try on anything that she pulls. Yes. So. <laughs> well, it's better that we have two that we love, right? Yes. 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 My gut feeling is the first dress. Tony Ward. Oh, it's just special. Do you still love it? I still love it. I love it even more than I did before I tried it on. Yeah. I mean, you look so elegant and sophisticated. I love this one. So, do you all love it? I love, love it. it. I love it. It's absolutely magnificent. So we've got to keep our fingers crossed. Randy's trying to find out now. Oh. We're hoping that we can get it new. It's beeping. I feel like this is what I would want to wear on my wedding day. We lost connection with him. I mean, it is Lebanon. At he might not be. Alive. Yeah, what time? It's. Um, he might not. It was about ten. Why can't I get that? Clock at night. Eleven o'clock at night. I get to try on dresses every week, and I get new things made for me all the time, but standing in this Tony War dress, I feel amazing, but I really hope that it can get rushed. It's beeping. Hi, Tony. Jenny from Dancing with the Stars. She loves the summer gown, but we need it in four weeks. What do you think? Yes, of course, we'll do it in four weeks. I love Okay, okay, okay. All right, I'm gonna message you now. Okay, love you, bye. I'm not gonna tell her yet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold her in suspense. <laughs> okay. Woo! 
Okay. Oh, Jenna, see what that does for your gorgeous face. <laughs> she said that. The face. It is, though. I love it. I just like, I love the sleeves. I love the, the turtleneck. I feel spectacular in this. But did you find out? Well, I spoke with Joan and Alicia, and they tried to call Tony, but he actually just landed in Paris. Oh, no. So it's like, you know, 11 o'clock at night. OK. So. But he said he would do it. <gasps> really? Yeah. No way. Four weeks. What? Four weeks. Oh, oh, my god. I literally can't believe it. I don't know what is happening. It feels like Christmas today. <laughs> yeah. He landed in Paris and said yes. yes for he just crazy. landed in Paris. They asked him and he said, absolutely. Ah. I cannot wait to wear this dress and hopefully I make Tony Ward proud. I I just think she's so gorgeous right now. She just, mom. I know, Stop. I'm just gonna get so <laughs> emotional, but it's so beautiful. What do you think that Val would say? Will he love it? You know what? Yeah, he love you. When I feel confident and powerful and sexy and strong, I exude beauty to him. And I know that, he tells me that. And so I think Val's really gonna love this dress. I can't wait for him to see it, I really can't. Should we ask her the question? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to do this my whole life! Yes! <laughs> Jenna, are, are you, you saying, saying yes, yes to the dress? I'm saying yes! I said yes to a dress. I met Randy. My mom cried. What more could you ask for? Okay. Okay, you ready? In. Go out. And then out. out. I'm gonna spin and it. Then in. I'm... And dip. Whoa. Yeah. You are ready. I don't know if I kept my my cage up the whole it's time. It's him with the stars. I know. The next <laughs> celebrity. Woo! <laughs> yes. What a great day this was. Oh. It's official. Today is the day. Doom, doom, doom. We're heading to Kleinfeld. Y'all yeah. do know that I don't want anything close to a white dress. I don't want nothing resembling white. I want the most unique wedding dress in the world. Wow. It is beautiful. Wow. Oh, my goodness. The public got to know me on a show called The Apprentice with Donald Trump. I was the tough girl in the boardroom, unapologetically ambitious. For a living, I am a business professor at the Howard University School of Business. That is me, so me. In pink, I would wear that. I don't even want to try on a white dress because I was engaged to Michael Clark Duncan. I had chosen this beautiful white dress for that occasion. I went from planning our wedding four years ago to planning his funeral because he passed away. And so um, I went through a really tough uh, period after he passed and a really long period of grieving and just soul searching. So I want to do something that is so reflective of this new chapter of my life. Lisa, have your bride. Now? Yeah, yeah, she's here and uh, guess who it is? Who? Amorosa. Amorosa from The Apprentice? From The Apprentice. She's here to buy a wedding dress. She's on the Trump team. That's right. Oh boy. Have fun. <laughs> Thank I'm you. I'm sure you will. She's a. Uh, Great personality. All right, I've got to go find Randy. I think you need to. I think you'll need his help for this one. <laughs> Without a doubt. For Thanks, sure. Dorothy. Of course. Do me. Shot? Do it. Yeah, ready? girl. Do it. Oh, there. Oh. And the oh. princess has arrived. Oh. <laughs> Hello, beautiful. <laughs> nice to meet you. Oh. Nice to meet you. How are you? Meet my mama. Oh, yeah, your, your mama. That's mama Rosa. <laughs> mama Rosa, the queen. I'm the youngest the of princess. four children. Hi, Mama okay. Rosa. I'm Lisa. Nice to meet you. Pleasure. I'm the youngest of seven. I'm the youngest of seven, too. You are. I only talked Astrid. about two of them. <laughs> What's your name? Astrid? Astrid. Nice to meet you. Hi, this is Lisa. Astrid. I'm Lisa. Nice, nice to meet you. Meet you. And this beautiful. is Aisha. Aisha. We worked in the White House together. White House? We, we got to have some power crew here. So let's, let's talk about wedding. Since that's why you're here. Congratulations on your engagement. Yeah. Whoa. Oh my God. Honey, that's like six rings put together. My fiance is Dr. John Allen Newman. John and I met while serving on a board for a charity that helps inner city youth learn the game of golf. He is so caring. He loves the Lord. He loves me. He's so smart, like 
super duper smart. So tell us about your wedding. That's so, what I want to hear about. Me and John met in Washington, D.C. Our first date was during the Cherry Blossom Festival, oh. and I want to capture that evening in my wedding. Gorgeous. I want to recreate the cherry blossoms. I want that beautiful floral smell, because it is truly the spirit of newness, of spring, of renewal. And for me, this is a new start. But I do not want a white dress. No, well. So what are you thinking? I'm thinking anything but a white dress. I want to walk in the church and let them know the First Lady has, has arrived. arrived. <laughs> <laughs> OK, okay. she said it. Lady O is, um, it's the nickname that the ladies at the church call me because I will be the First Lady of the Sanctuary of Mount Calvary. It's the name of the church. So what kind of silhouette are you thinking? Well, have you seen all this? Honey, I know. So what are you thinking? I, I, mermaid? No. Oh. Big ball mermaid. gown. Ball I gown. Want, oh. You want a ball gown. OK. I want, I want drama. What's the budget? Drama. Honey, with that ring, there's no budget, OK? <laughs> <laughs> I can say that right now. I want drama. I want pizzazz. I need everything at the same time. I know what dress you're thinking. <laughs> Yes, that's it! I know. <laughs> I mean, okay, let's talk about this dress for a second. I mean, this is ridiculous. Blossoms. If this isn't her dress, yeah. literally, I don't yeah. know what is. Yeah, well, there's this. Well, I know, <laughs> this is, I know. This is coming to America, this is Cherry Blossom. This is really fun because Amorosa wants a dress that's colorful and vibrant and a statement maker, and we don't always get to pull dresses like that. Okay, wow. look, coming to America dress, look at that. Wow. Is that fit for a princess? That is amazing. What do you oh think? My God, I love them. I want to try this one on first. We, we, we may start with this one. It's like, because this you know, is my a, wedding. Here, but here, here's the thing, because the committee's going to knock down the first dress. They always do. Oh. Well, if you want to, it's up to you. I, I'll try this. Let's it's do your, this. It's first. your appointment. You can do whatever you want. No, let's I, look. You all are the experts. One thing I learned <laughs> in business is find the folks who know what they're doing and trust their expertise. Okay. All right. All right. Number. See you in a few. Enjoy, ladies. Bye. Thank you, Randy. So we're going to take Randy's advice, and we're not going to start with Omarosa's favorite dress. So I'm going to put Omarosa in this beautiful regal pink ball gown. It's embellished. It's wow. It really makes a statement. <laughs> it's crazy gorgeous, right? OK, let's go, let's go. OK. Immediately, I feel confident. I feel very bold. I feel very fashion forward. I'm in love with this dress. Whoa. Oh. Wow. So I tell mean, me what you love about it. I love, first of all, it fits my shape. Yeah. It like pulls Any you dress. in. It looks like a princess. I love that. It's great for my coloring. It's yeah. pink. Yeah. It's right. got bling. <laughs> Woo! Thank you, Jesus. Okay. okay. Is the committee ready? We're ready. Yes. We're ready. Can I get an amen? All amen. Right. Wow. wow. It is pretty. Y'all never agree on anything. This is so weird. It's exactly yeah. what I was thinking, actually. Really, so Monica? Thoughts, yes, that's okay, right Anna, along the line. My fashion expert. The color is absolutely stunning. I love the drama. It's regal. It's perfect for a pastor's wife. I love this dress. Okay. I know this is so my personality, but do I have to try on another dress? Yes. 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 You can't. Yes. I'll be, I be honest, I'm still out. I'm I still out on this. Randy? Let me tell you why. Randy's Honestly, about to get hit in the head by four Bibles. I'm sorry. I <laughs> uh, know. For me, I'm looking at the dress. I'm not looking at you. Oh, no, honey, you looking at me. Randy made me put this on first. Randy's a little bossy. I'm sorry. Ah! He was you like, oh, they're going to shoot this. And all the committee was like, it. yes. Okay, why? Well, Randy's never worked with a bride like Lady O. Right okay, there. so we've got some more to try on. Yes. Okay. We both are very, very strong personalities. And when two bulls come together, sometimes they lock horns. <laughs> All right, the cherry blossom dress. Cherry blossom. Omarosa is having a cherry blossom theme wedding, so this dress is going to be a perfect match. This is everything I wanted in a dress. Exactly. That's why you can't say yes to the first dress, because you never know what's around the corner. Doom, 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 doom. 
Okay. You look like a very sweet, innocent Southern belle. <gasps> I do. Just keep talking. How do you feel in this dress? I feel very, very beautiful. What would the pastor say? He would love this one over the other one, <laughs> except for the boobies. Really? Why? Too much boobies. Really? Well, we could probably have her raise it. It's a lot. I think once you raise the cup, you're going to be good with this. Yeah, because Randy, Randy, the girl's trying out. to get into heaven. Unless I'm going to be your plus one, the cup is just Where do these come from? God. OK, he made them. Oh, that's so a good one. So he should be one. proud of them. That's a good one. <laughs> oh, see? Uh-oh. These faces are not good. Like, womp, womp. To me, it just looks like a regular evening dress. Do you like it, Mom? It's very literal. Cherry blossoms? It's not that it's ugly. It's just that yeah. we don't think. It's not think a wedding dress. It's not. Yeah. No. Wow. No. 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 This is not the dress. I want to hear what Randy has okay, to say. Okay, go ahead. You know what? It's your wedding, and I work for you. Okay. I want you to be happy, and you looked happy in that other dress. If it had the train and the bling and the over okay. the cherry blossoms. But it doesn't. No. But it doesn't. doesn't. That's not That's there. what's That's missing. Not you girls better have cherry blossoms at my bachelorette party. <laughs> <laughs> Note taken. I'm going to say yeah. no. no. I'll yeah. join the committee. It's yeah. no. It's okay. a no. I was surprised at how much they just like the dress. It's a perfect dress. Hi, Allie. Hi, Hi I'm Christiana. Nice to Welcome meet you. Welcome to Kindfall. Hi. I'm Shelly, hey, Allie's mom. mom. Nice to meet you. Kathy. Kathy, nice to meet you. Hi. You're her sister, I'm guessing. <laughs> Grandpa Charlie. Nice to meet you. Congratulations. Thank you. So tell me about your wedding. We're getting married in Bermuda at the Mid Ocean Club. It's on the beach. Do you have anything in mind? No, I'm pretty open. Okay. I'll have simple style, but it is the one day that you can really look special, so I'm going to try and keep an open mind today. What do you ladies see her in? We're, we are waiting for a very good friend of mine okay. who's running a little late. Not I hope a that's problem. okay. Because she's our fashionista. Hello, hello, hello. That late arrival is none other than Joan Rivers, comedian, queen of the fashion critics, and doyen of the red carpet. Joan Rivers is here, which is so exciting, super exciting. I was with Thank Donald Trump. Thank you so Trump. much for coming. Uh -huh. Congratulations. Thank you. I met Joan through a very close friend of mine over 20 years ago. There is nobody in the world that I think has better taste than Joan. I'm Christiana. Nice to see you. I'm nice so to sorry you. I'm late. Okay. You know what, Joan? Very exciting. You're worth waiting for. What do we got? Well, we just started. OK. Um, Bermuda, beach wedding, something lightweight. I was so excited that Joan could make it, but also a little bit nervous because I've been at so many family functions with her before when she's just taken one look at me and said, Allie, what in the world are you wearing? Let's start. OK, great. OK. Okay. Have you ever been to a beach wedding? No. I think a beach wedding is stupid. It's very generational. You're getting a good family and a good girl. Absolutely. And a stupid beach wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Have a seat. Thank you. Tell me about your fiance. My fiance's name is Christopher Ward. So we've been dating for seven and a half years. We met in college. We were friends first, and when we went abroad together, that sort of when it changed from being friends to more. He proposed in Central Park. I was so surprised, like embarrassingly surprised. I was wearing like gym clothes. I can't even tell you how much I wasn't expecting it. Tell me about your price point. Um, I want to make sure that it's below 15. Below 15,000. Okay, perfect. With such a healthy budget, Allie's able to try on a dress she saw earlier. My mom picked out the big ball gown. I know that it's a big day, so people are trying to encourage me to hopefully get something a little bit more special. Oi. <laughs> I'm not only thinking about, will Allie like this, but I'm definitely thinking, will Joan Rivers like this? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What do you guys think? It looked like she was sitting on a toilet paper roll. <laughs> I thought the bottom looked like a cupcake. I think she could do better. Are you on the beach? On beach? the beach. <laughs> I just want to get no shoes, right? <laughs> no shoes. You can't have a train. She's going to be on the beach. And you can't have huge ruffles and a huge train because you will be dragging shrimp and lobsters right up there with you. No. Off. <laughs> Off. Are those real diamonds? <laughs> <laughs> if they were, would we be sitting here? <laughs> <laughs> so Allie returns to her original idea. She chooses a simple sheath dress. So what do you think about this one? 
It's romantic, it's speechy, it's simple. There's nothing not to like about it. What do you guys think? This is more. Why not just go right to bed? Yeah, that's for after the this wedding. This is for after the wedding. I hate this dress. I think it's special with the back. I think that it's, you know, beachy. It's sort of the opposite of what the last one was. Yeah, the back is okay, but they're going to see the front. Why do you want to have a minimalistic, stupid nightgown on when you, it's your one chance to be the star of the show? Yeah, it's a, it's a guest dress. Yeah, it's very simple. It's a, it's a very thin, ugly guest dress. <laughs> so, a no-go? You'll be That's so... No. No. 100% wrong. After striking out on the first two dresses, I don't really know what I want. I don't know what anyone else wants. Across the salon, Joan has taken over Allie's appointment, picking what she thinks is the perfect gown. Where are you? We found your dress. It's flowy, it's modern, it's edgy, and yet it's still traditional. Your mother likes it too. What do you think? I think it's pretty. Well, I'm excited, excited to show them this on. Pretty, pretty, pretty. What do you Beautiful. guys think? I think you look really pretty in this dress. Yeah. I'm looking at Ellie, and her whole face is glowing. I love the top of the dress. I love the ruching. I love these details with the cutouts. I think they're beautiful. It's my favorite part of the dress. I like it because it's... It's fun. Think on a beach, a little breeze, moving in the sand. One word, wow. <laughs> we want a big veil. When you're a bride, more is more. I hate minimalism on a bride, so stupid. There we go. When she put on the veil, I basically brought tears to my eyes. I thought she looked beautiful. Whose dress is this? Marie Macro. I love her. Now, I'm just thinking. I want to do a satin. A little satin. Or let Reem do the uh, cutout on here. That'd be pretty, a veil that matches. Yeah, that, that matches. You know what I'm saying? I love that we said, let's go and make the veil of the same fabric. Because I wasn't sure that I wanted a veil, but I really oh. do love. I know. <laughs> you have it's but the I love only it. time I in your do. life, unless you're going to be a nun, that you can wear a veil. No, I so agree. wear the veil. It gave it a little traditional look, just a little, which will make everybody over 45 in the room very happy. Show <laughs> those best. I was looking at myself uh, in the mirror with a veil on, and I felt like a bride. Are you saying yes to the dress? I'm saying yes to the dress. Yeah. Uh, Allie says yes to the $8,000 Reem Acra dress picked out for her by Joan Rivers. My best advice to Allie is love your husband, adore your husband, cherish your husband, and get everything from the beginning in your name. It's going to be amazing. Yay! I'm Bailey Horn, and I'm back at Kleinfeld today because I'm having doubts about my wedding dress. Today, I brought my mother, my sister, and my grandmother. There's only one time in your life when you get to have a bridal moment. That's, That's really pretty. Day. Day. I like that. So I'm coming back to try on my dress and maybe try on a few other options to make sure that I made the best decision. Here to help a employee of my publicist choose her wedding gown. And I take it very seriously. This is a serious decision. Hi, Bailey. Hi, Martha. Thank you so much for coming. I understand that you have a slight dilemma. Yes, I thought you could be very useful. Martha is the bridal expert, and I hope this is just going to be really fun. I already bought a dress, but I'm having doubts. What does it look like? It's really beautiful, but I'm kind of nervous that it's not looking so bridal. Okay. We're going to try it on again. Okay, you could try this one on. Did you try put, that on? I didn't try this. Oh. I said it might be out of my budget. Oh, don't think about the budget. <laughs> I feel very touched that Bailey would invite me having had a daughter who wore a gray flannel suit to her wedding. Any chance I get to help a bride is fun. This was pretty, too. It's in a vineyard, so I don't want super formal. Oh, it's in the vineyard? My wedding is going to be on the North Fork of Long Island at a vineyard. It's an outdoor ceremony, and then the cocktail hour is in this glass greenhouse. It's going to be elegant and romantic. Just a really great day. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> I'm really excited that Martha's here today. When it comes to wedding dresses and wedding planning, Martha's reputation is perfection. Bailey, really? having a dilemma. What's the dilemma? I'm just doubting my dress. You know what? You should never doubt your wedding no, dress. No, I don't think you, so. It's, I... a, it's like doubting your fiance, right? <laughs> Not 100 quite. Sure. Well, 
<laughs> so what do you think you're looking for, Bailey, that you're missing in that first dress? The first dress is absolutely beautiful. It's romantic. I just don't know if it's the bridal moment. Every bride is different. Every bride has dreams and thoughts and, and worries and challenges. It would be a good time for you and I maybe to go shopping. Okay. I think the dress a bride wears should be her dream dress. And you're certainly going to find that dream dress in a place like this. OK. Wow. Here we go, right here, right here. It's very similar to her dress. And it's, and it's a little more full on the bottom, I think. You like it? I like it. I'll pull it in. Yeah, you pull know. it in. Randy showed me the storerooms, which are incredible. And this one's more sparkly oh, that's as pretty, well. But that's prettier. Oh, it has yeah. a fuller bottom yeah. and has a little more coverage up here. Oh, try that. OK. Oh, God, I could just look forever. I would have so much fun in here. Right? <laughs> it's astonishing how many dresses are in the back. I'd love to try on, like, hundreds of them. They're so pretty. <laughs> Let me tell you, I love what I'll I do. I'll have to get married again. Hi. Hi. You're beautiful. Hi. I've got Martha here. Oh, wow. Hi, I'm Martha. After spending some time in the stock room, Martha and I found a variety of dresses for Bailey to try on. Martha thought this one, it's got a little more fullness at the bottom, and it's a more tonal beading, and it's got a little more coverage here. Oh, that's beautiful. Um, it's not so stiff here. It looks, it looks gorgeous. Yeah. But we'll try it. You mm -hmm. never know. I'm a lucky lady. Not many people get to have Martha Stewart go wedding dress shopping for them. This would have to be. <laughs> Wait, take a talk in my underwear. This is so exciting. I love all of your products. And, Thank you. You know, I'm an elementary school art teacher. I don't know. And I have, so I'm very crafty myself. Oh, good. Oh, good. <laughs> I feel super excited to be here today. You know, if Martha's here and she can help in any way, you know, go for it. Hi, Martha. Hi. I'm a massive fan. Thank um, you. I just bought your book. <laughs> Martha Look Stewart Weddings. Uh, it's a comprehensive guide for the bride and the bride's family and anybody doing wedding planning. And Although I'm married already, but I'm just a huge fan. No, you work here. You need <laughs> yeah. this book. Now, your first name is Nicole. Nicole. I mean, how exciting is this? Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> Oh my. Oh, look at the back. It's a little it's low. It's a little low. <laughs> it's a little low. It's a beautiful dress, but it's a little revealing for me. I actually think I feel more bare in this. You are. It's more plunging neckline. Yeah. It doesn't flatter your figure as well. I don't feel like myself in this. I'd be very subconscious about my back. Let's no, it's not. Well. It's not attractive. It's not as flattering to, to on you. Above all, the wedding dress oh, has to fit flatter, and feel good. I think this is a no. Thank you, Martha, for trying to push me out of my comfort zone, but it's just not going to work this time. Aha, here it is. Look how beautiful. Since the last dress was too revealing for Bailey, she wants to try on the original dress that she bought. Bailey! My dress. So I'm anxious to see your beautiful daughter in her chosen dress. Me too. I know that she has some second thoughts about the one that she picked out. I don't know why I thought it was absolutely gorgeous on her. This is so pretty, Bailey. It is. It's really. As soon as I put the dress on, it feels great. I remember all the reasons I picked it, but I'm definitely nervous. I'm not sure if Martha is going to like this dress. Oh, oh my god, it's so gorgeous. Yes, beautiful. What are your thoughts? Well, you have to tread lightly. Can't say, oh, that's a horrible dress that she's already chosen. It's gorgeous. I think it's very uh, flattering. Now looking at the structure again and the fit, it definitely feels more bridal than I remember it. So it's really about what's missing in this. Absolutely. It's very just like straight. Yeah. I just think it's a little rigid. Maybe more fullness at the bottom? Maybe more fullness. I just I think agree. it should I be agree. your dream dress. Let's turn, now let's you, turn you around. You look beautiful, Bailey. Magnificent. Do you like it as much as the first time? I like it more, I think. I need to make sure that the dress I get is my dress without a doubt, and I have no questions. Do you think if we added a little crinoline to the bottom, it would make you feel better? Oh, I didn't realize that was an option. That could be oh, interesting. Of course. Yeah. Do it in here. Adding crinoline to the bottom of the dress is going to make it fuller and poofier and a little more grand. I really think she's going to like this addition. 
Okay. I'm definitely nervous. My concerns are that I try on the dress and I hate it, and then I can't find another dress that I like. And now we're getting close to the wedding and I don't have a dress. Hold this for me. Bailey loves the fit of her original dress, but we're gonna add some crinoline to this one to give it a little more fullness. You know, depending, of course, on what dress she chooses, then comes the headdress. Right. And this book goes through everything. Bailey has a strong opinion, and she wants to make sure that her opinion is right. Wait, I might like it, actually, with the crinoline. Good. So it adds a little fullness. It looks really pretty. I actually like it. All right, good. I really like the extra volume on the bottom. It makes the dress feel a little bit more bridal. Okay, ladies, we have the crinoline on now. So you see it gives a little fullness at the bottom. It's just that little bit of extra that I was looking for. What does Martha think? <laughs> Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, look how nice. Fitting a crinoline underneath looks great. Really the perfect dress for Bailey. She looks good, really good. Makes you look taller, more elegant. Yeah, very nice. To have Martha say that you look good in your wedding dress, it just gives you that extra bit of confidence. This is my dress. I don't need to try on a million others. Would you like to see a veil? Something just simple, soft. Maybe I'll ask the big question. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to say yes, yes to, to the dress? dress? I'm saying again. yes to the dress again. Yay! I really love it. It is really beautiful. It made me realize that I just have to trust my gut and go with it, and everything will work out. No. Thank you best for your help. help. Best of I luck. think reinforcing her original choice is the best result possible. She can dance all night long in that dress and feel very, very happy. So Whitney, just have a seat in that first okay. chair. So tell me about your fiance. We met actually on Survivor. On the show? Yes. So. We've got one heck of a story. My fiance's name is Keith Tollefson, and he is the most handsome man I've ever seen. And if you had told me I was gonna find the one on a TV show, I would have said, you're crazy. We made an alliance on day one in the game, and here we are today, <laughs> still in an alliance. In that setting, we really saw the worst of each other. So it's like, if you can fall in love with that, we got it made. <laughs> okay, I'll be back. Okay. Since Whitney seems to know what she's looking for, I want to get Randy's help because I think it has to be something a little bit different, but still her style. She's actually an aspiring country music singer songwriter. Oh, yeah. yeah. They're used to wearing a lot of gowns at different galas. So lace is a great direction because it's, it's... It's distinguishing between yeah. a bridal gown then and an a evening, evening gown. Now, what do you think of this? This is a brand new... And that's Kavisa. Kavisa. lace, so it's Kavisa. different, yeah. It is so pretty on. Yeah. Hey, Whitney, hey. this is Randy Hello. 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 How are you? What do you think of this? Uh, I kind of love that. Oh. Let's stick with this one first, okay. and then we'll go down the line. I like okay, it. ladies, right, great. have fun. Great. Thanks, Randy. Dress one is a $4,800 Ramona Caveza with intricate cotton lace. Oh. You look awesome. Wow. I love it. It's fitted, it flares just enough. This you can do both Nashville and beach. And beach. What do you think? I love it. I do too. I don't love the neckline. Really? really? I don't like the thing sticking up. I think the whole point of the dress is the neckline. Laura showed some reservation about the lace, but I actually really like the top and how the lace comes up. I love this. It's a good start. This is the dress to be. Yeah, it is. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Okay. okay. We thought you might be interested in these. I like that. I'll be interested to try that one. The girls brought me two dresses. One of them looked great. The other one was like, mm, mm But I did try on the one that looked the most like something I would like. Ooh, I like that one. I like that one. How do you feel? It's pretty. There's a lot I like about it. I just feel like it's kind of safe. I love it. I like yeah. the sweetheart on that. I like the neckline on that one a lot. I feel like it's pretty, but it's 
kind of boring. It's kind of safe. It's just a wedding dress. I don't feel like it's mine when I put it on. I feel like it's just not special. It just looks like a wedding dress. That one doesn't look like you. It's the one that I thought that I would like, because we all picked it out, but it's not her. So, okay. let's keep going. We're going to veto it. this. OK. It was a good pick. Yeah, good pick, guys. Yeah. Real good pick. Whitney is looking for a romantic gown that gives her some curves. Dress one is her top choice. Next, Christiana puts her in a sexy lace panina. Whoa, how do you feel? I kind of love it. <laughs> I think you're smoking in it. Yeah, <laughs> you look great. This is a different girl yeah. than the yeah. first. I love it. <laughs> You love it. Yeah. I feel like both of the dresses are you. Because you're like hot and sexy, and that can be your dress for the day. Or you could be like organic, down to earth, and Whitney. Yeah. And Which that's what you are, too. Day. I am shocked that they are liking this dress so much. I love the back in this, though. This dress is completely different than the first dress. Oh, dang it. I do like it. It's making me have conflicting feelings, which I don't want to. <laughs> I really think the deciding factor is getting back into the first dress. I think comparing it back to back and seeing just how it feels and think I will know which is the right one. Oh, it's that one again. How do you feel now that you have it back on? I mean, I love it. It's more me. I couldn't agree with you more. Really? It's more yeah. you as a bride. Yeah. 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 Like, I can see you in that other dress. You look severely sexy in it. But this is more Winnie as a bride. Yeah. yeah. I love the other one, but this one is, it's the one. I love it. That's your dress. You light up. When you walked yes. out, you lit up. You were like glowing. Yeah. You were glowing. You, feel, you look like you feel comfortable in it. It's and much more confident. comfortable. Yeah. That's pretty. How's that? Yeah, that's right. better. Yes. How do you feel? I love it. Is this your wedding dress? Are you saying yes to the dress? Saying yes to the dress! <laughs> Get the whole salon screaming. Whether on the beach or in the backyard, Whitney will look stunning in this $4,800 gown by Ramona Caveza. I think this dress could really fit anywhere. So it's not really going to help me figure out the location. <laughs> now i got to plan this thing. <laughs> Hi, ladies. Are you Julie? Hi, I am. Hi. My name is Julie Trussell, and I am here to find my second dress for my reception. So you brought a beautiful group with you. I did. I brought my mom and my bridesmaids and my boss and really good friend and bridesmaid, Kristen Chenoweth. Kristen, a pleasure to meet you. Kristen and I are very close. We're like sisters. I'm the younger sister by 10 years. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She is the love of my life. I call her my non-sexual life partner. We've crossed over into that unhealthy thing where you're not supposed to be best friends with your assistant. But there is a bond here. Maybe it's because I didn't grow up with a little sister. I hope that I've been some sort of good example in her life. I know she has been in mine. I love her. What's your first dress look like? It's very classic, just mm -hmm. kind of a fit and flair. Very, very practical. Well, I've really been pushing her to try to go outside of her comfort zone and be, I like a lot of bling, and I like, um, of course, this isn't about me, right? Sorry. <laughs> Kristen loves to be in the spotlight. Not being the center of attention. Hmm. And on my wedding day, she has us to sing three songs. I'm going to try to let her have her moment. I'll believe it when I see it. <laughs> I did see a tiara out there, so. Oh, no. I'm sure somehow by the end of the day, we'll end up on her head. I would just give anything for her to have just one sequin, even if it's under her arm. But let me just talk about her taste. Plain. Wake me when it's over. I want something really fun and short with maybe a little bling. I will be able to do it. I hope so. I'm going to yes. find that dress that both Kristen and I like. Oh, I can And then you can it. borrow it after. OK. So Julie, tell me what's comfortable for you price-wise. $8,000. Where is the wedding going to be? It's in Santa Barbara um, on a working ranch. It's going to be a little bit of rustic elegance. We're looking the ocean. My fiance's name is Paul Kahn. He's my other half, and he's my best friend. And we can't wait to spend our lives together. They met 
because of a show I was on, they met. She Great. takes credit for me meeting my fiance. I brought you to New York. You got a fiance and I got nothing. I keep thinking, doesn't he have a brother? Or if it doesn't work out, I'm available. I've already offered myself, like a sister wife, but they're like ex-nay on the Easter wife say. Well, what do you think, ladies? Is everybody ready? Yes. It's going to be a challenge to find a dress that's out of her comfort zone, but one that she's comfortable in. I need a short dress. I could see me getting married in this dress right here. Of course, I'm not. Absolutely. I'm not even engaged. This is a short dress from Henry Roth, but again, it's it's nothing like what she's asking for. I mean, she's so classic. She's like a Grace Kelly. Mm -hmm. Don't you think yeah, she's like yeah. Grace Kelly? She knows her style. Oh she, has a, she has a real distinct there style and everything. crowns over there. I'm going to just. Do the wave. Yeah. <laughs> I love so. tiaras. What's wrong with me? The pageant wave, long, long, short, short, short pearls. I like it. I definitely want the entourage to see it. <gasps> Isn't this adorable? Short dress. What do we think? It's, it looks like crumpled up paper. No, I don't like the bottom. It looks like a big diaper. It was a big no. OK, for you. not yeah. the dress for me. Yeah. It was too plain. There were so many things wrong about it for me. Kristen Chenoweth and her assistant, Julie, are so close, they're like sisters. And Julie's taken her style lead. I like a lot of bling. So Kristen's taken over the salon. This is as big as Heidi Klum. Oh, I want to try this one on. Yeah, that's probably more you than her. It doesn't hurt to look. Don't you think that this is just the most beautiful dress? I love this because I think it will make you look like tall. Me? Why don't you go try this dress on? And then I can see what it looks like on you and I'll see. Try yeah, it. I'll take it. <laughs> I, everybody wins. I've never seen a model this short before, but you should totally no, be what? my model. You oh. are fired. No, no, I'll get some no, I got it. I got it. It's mayhem out here. Kristen is really taking over. Oh, I so got it. Emily, hurry up. I'm very, very much all about being sisterly. I might be little, but I'm strong. This is my dress. I mean, your dress. I was happy to offer my services that way. Help! Oh. Isn't it beautiful? Yes. I want it. Boyfriend. <gasps> I'm dying. Please say a prayer for me. We. I don't know. I'm not surprised that she tried to dress on. I wouldn't expect anything less. You don't even know what a big moment this is. I'm saying yes to your dress. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Julie, if you don't say yes to this dress, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna lie, I wanna try it on. <gasps> no. Okay. Because if my boobs can look like that. <laughs> You can just go to Park and 73rd and all <laughs> No, I'm kidding. Mine are real. This would look fabulous short. Oh, Julie. Because she looked fantastic in it, what she looks and everything, it made me try it on. OK, I'll try it on if you want me She's to. She's going to try it on. OK. I have to take it off. This isn't about me, though. This isn't about me. But I will never get tired of playing dress up. I'm so sad. I think you're going to like it. Julie may love Kristen Chenoweth like a sister, but she's having doubts about her dress choices. I actually don't know if it's the right dress. Really? So everybody, I mean, you like this dress? I love it. I'm giving it a 10. I love it. I love it. I mean, at first, I was a little bit skeptical, but I needed to go out of my comfort zone a little bit. Mm -hmm. I love it, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I would be excited to take my ceremony dress off and put this on for my reception. Well, that's the whole point. Yeah. It's perfect. I was ready to rip it off her body and put it on my own. I love it so much. So, Julie, are we going to say yes to the dress? We're going to say yes to the dress. <laughs> like a glove, and I felt confident and sexy. It was my dress. So beautiful. I think it's perfect. She's going to feel beautiful and have fun in it. Julie said yes to her $9,000 Mark Zanino stunner. I love it. So we've got Bailey. Yes. OK. Nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. Beautiful. Swaggy? Swaggy. It's a pleasure. Appreciate you. Welcome. Man.
you're the fiance. Yes, sir. We met on Big Brother, which is we met on the we show. We met on the show. Now on Big Brother, you guys all live in the same house, yes. right? Uh -huh. Yes. So you were living together before yes. you were even dating. Yes. Yeah. Big Brother was crazy. Uh, they throw you into a house and you're isolated with a bunch of cameras everywhere, and like you got to watch your words, but also compete at the highest level, and then like. Sixteen people, one bathroom. That's all I have to say. That's it. Yeah. Mm. And the bathroom does not lock. Yeah. I'm gonna say it again, it doesn't lock. And the reason why I like him so much is because he did my laundry in the house and I was like, he's husband material. <laughs> it was completely a surprise. Never in a thousand years did I expect to meet my husband though. Not at all. I was not going on Big Brother to meet a wife. I was going there to win the game. Yeah. And after 23 days of us being in the house together, he proposed the next time I saw him. So I would say that our love story is pretty unique. Pretty crazy. So, tell us about you guys' wedding. It is on an island in the Bahamas. So yes. I see something light and... Something light and... and tool yes, and, and flowy. Mm -hmm. Flowy, okay. But then, you know, we have to have the silhouette for the goddess part, because okay. they need to, you know... So a little... A little... Show the figure. You know, a little... A little... A little... A little... Uh, sexy, classy, or sweet? Uh, sexy and classy, because at the end of the day, when that wedding is over, it's me and you, right? Okay. And now, are you going to be here during the appointment? 100%. I'm looking at every single dress. I'm just no, not going to be no. there. No, no, no. Yes, no. yes, yes. This is his and wedding, too. This is my too. wedding. So he wants dress. to be here every during the whole dress. Every, every, every single dress. dress. Just, when I make the yes. decision, I will kick him out. Yeah. yeah. I got to get this straight, so I have to understand. So you're staying for the appointment, mm -hmm. but you're not going to let him know what dress it is. Yes. Not at all. I got to leave. So here's the thing. I don't see how she can put on the dress and Swaggy not know it. I mean, he's gonna know that it's her dress just by her body language. I don't know how this is gonna work out. And how much would you guys like to spend? Our budget is 5000 Okay, you guys ready? Come on. Okay. Let's do it. So we're gonna walk this way. It's important that I get a dress here today because my wedding is actually in a few months and I need a dress ASAP. So you're th are you thinking more of like a mermaid yeah, silhouette? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. I'm thinking so, but it's so hard because you know how sometimes a mermaid silhouette you can't walk in? Yes. What's this? Like you were ever going to try on dresses with her. Oh, there we go. Come on, here we go. And it begins. Okay. Yeah. He's yes. like, really, though? Yeah, I don't even know what to do out there. I can't sit out there. Like, But okay. here's the thing. You've been dressing her for how long? Years. Yeah. Since years. Like 14. 10 plus years. Okay, so yeah. we may need your help on this. Yeah, I mean, I, right? I don't even know that you know how to get into a dress without me. I have a stylist mm -hmm. um, because <laughs> I need style. I'm about to say I it, am. Though. I literally have been modeling freshly since I was 14, and it's so much easier to have people tell me what to wear and then to actually pick it out myself. Should we bring him with us? Take him with you. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Have fun. Okay. Okay. See you soon. Wish us luck. I will. Okay. Oh my God. Hey. Side here. Coming up. And is it? I feel like I'm swimming in gowns. Oh yeah. It's kind of like the most exciting part for me is seeing the back. Like, I, I'm excited to see her in dresses, but like, you get to see all the dresses on the racks in the back. That's awesome. I That's think that it's gonna frame her face. Really pretty. It's got that sexy, flowy, floaty, goddessy look. We're definitely kinda. on the right track. When you're doing a destination wedding, especially some place where it's gonna be warm um, outside, you want to pick something that's not going to be too hot and heavy, like satin or mikado. You want a lighter fabric, like a crepe or a lace or a chiffon. Something that is not going to make you sweat all day. I mean, it's going to be hot. We've got a lot of great options. Oh, Gang's my gosh. Here. The gang's all here. Gang's all here. OK. They walk into the dressing room, and I am getting styles all over the place. But there's a few that pop out to me. So I know that we have something special in this bunch. This is Haley Page. Okay, I like that a lot. You do? Yes, I do okay. like that a lot. Yeah, let's start, start with, with that. That one. To we, the, that we, one. We like this, this gown, I'm a little bit iffy about because I feel like it's not really her personality. But I know that the guys really gravitated towards this one while we were shopping together. So I'm a little interested to see which way she's gonna go. I just don't know. Like it's like this is beautiful, but I don't know if it's like the dress. You'll know. I'll know. You will. Okay. So I'm going out into this dress and I am just praying for good reviews. I know my family is picky and this might not be the dress, but at least it's something nice to look at. Your hair is gorgeous. Yeah, thank you. We just did like quick updo. And you know what? On the beach, it's gonna be a lot cooler like it that way too. Yes. So romantic, right? So here comes the firing squad. Let's see. All right. Dress one. Dress, dress one. number one. How are you feeling? 
Um, that's not it, but it's beautiful. It's cute. <laughs> it's cute. We're getting there. We're getting this there. This looks like a prom dress to me. Oh, yeah. Oh. But again, it's her wedding. Yeah. So if she loves it, I love it. It's but not it's, wedding. It's dress not my preference. Yeah, when no, you say not prom, it. that is not what we want to hear. We're not going to the prom. We have we have gone way past prom. We're, We're on to the wedding. Prom. They all have opinions. They all think it's about them. But the opinion that I value the most is, of course, Swaggy's, because this day is all about us, and his reaction is the only thing I'm looking forward to. Yeah, so, Swaggy. I know, I agree with her. That's not it, yes, but like, it. I'm like so in love with you. Like, just looking Aww. at you. That's so sweet. Like I said, I never pictured this day, but it feels like, like Brittany said, tingly a little bit. This is not the one, but you look great in it. So you ready? Yes. Ready? Let's Next just, year. just keep going. I think today's biggest challenge is all of these personalities getting on one page. I feel like this is gonna be a lot harder than I thought it was. Yeah, I'm scared. Oh, wow. This is Beach Goddess Princess, like we've been discussing. No, this is beautiful, and it's super simple, and it's, like, definitely up my alley. You shine in this gown. Yeah, this is, like, hot. It's getting super tricky, so we want to make sure that she stays happy and confident. So I'm putting Bailey in a gorgeous Randy Finoli gown. This actually was one of the first dresses that Randy was gravitating towards. Randy. This is your dress. Oh my God. How are you feeling? Holy. How are you feeling? Okay, so I'm feeling great. I love the way this looks. The silhouette is beautiful. I'm loving this right here. The back is what makes the dress for me. Everything. The dress is a 12 on a 10 point scale. It's everything simple, elegance, beauty, and I love it. Girl, I think this might be your dress. This might be it. Yeah. We just need, we need, we, we need the need team. We need to see what they we say. Need the team. We need the team. Ooh. Yeah. So what I'm thinking is that we get Walla in here, but I'm feeling so you like, don't want Chris I don't to see know it. if I want Chris to see okay, it. Okay, let me so get we, Walla. Yeah, we just Walla. have to see. Walla. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay. I know that I love this dress and I'm trying to see where people's opinions lie. So hopefully they love this dress too. Hi guys. Yeah. Oh. Um, she wants, she needs you. Usual. For a moment. Usual. You're being summoned. Okay. She I'm can't back. get dressed without thing, her bro. stylist. She, she don't know how to, yeah, she don't know how to put on dresses. Come in. Hi. Hi. Hello. Thoughts? I am obsessed you are. with this dress. Shut up. This is like beautiful. Bailey, this one is <laughs> Isn't it phenomenal? so fantastic. Yeah, I love can this. I, can I say one thing? Of course. Thank you for making my dress look so beautiful. Aww. Do that, man. Like, I walked in and I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh my God, that was just like, like you so really, flattering. You really make it look beautiful. Thank you. This I don't think that so we happy. show Chris this dress. Okay, we keep this one. Honestly, I think it's brilliant to come out in this dress because it's very, it is similar, yes. but the other one blows oh. this out of the water. Oh, yeah. With the slit up the front and the beading here. And the back. Yeah. Yes. So I think this is smart. I'm feeling a little bit nervous um, just because I know that if he loves this one, he will love the one that I've actually chosen. All right, oh. My baby is here. Wow. Yeah, that's yeah. beautiful. She looks gorgeous. I know I was gonna put like a headpiece on her. Like I'm trying to visualize it right now, but I can see it. And I genuinely love this dress. It checks off the boxes. Like it's sexy, but it's also classy, but it's also like simple and not like a lot of like bling and jewelry and stuff. Like it's, it's her. Yeah, this is a good moment. Yeah. Yeah. His eyes light up and that's what I needed to feel. Okay, great. Come kiss me and, and get out. Yeah. 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 Come kiss me Bye. and... Uh, it's hard that I have to do this and I don't want to do this, but he needs to go because I want him to be surprised. Like, I'm marrying you, not the dress. So yeah. whether you were the first one, the second one, the third one, I didn't care. I wanted you to be happy, feel good. Because I'm marrying you, that's all I care about. Okay. So, so no matter what I choose, you'll be happy? I don't care. As long as you walk down the aisle and marry me, I'm fine. Aw, love you. Love you too. Good guy. <gasps> good guy. So oh, <laughs> I feel better now. Uh, they just kicked me out, so I'm out here. I don't get to see the final dress, which I know is gonna be the dress that she wants. And he might not be happy with me, but I'm doing this for his best interest, and I want him to be extremely surprised on the day of our actual ceremony. Here she comes. Oh, Ooh. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Yeah. 
This and you are it. working this dress. Yeah, this one's it. This oh is my the god. One. Look at her walk in it. Look, yeah, look at her walk this in this. This is like my. Oh yeah. Do a circle you around the pedestal. Work. Look at this. Look at that. Give us a strip. Give us a strip. Ooh, look at the shoe. Man. Give us a strip. Floating. Wow. Check. What else? Goddess. 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 Check. Princess. 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 Yeah. Check. Bride. 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 Well, wait a second. We, we haven't done the bride yet. That'd be with the veil. Oh my God, it's happening. Uh, Do you feel it? It's happening. Do you feel it? <laughs> Do you yeah, feel it? That it's actually happening. just made the difference. That's, oh my God. It's more than I could have ever imagined. I mean, oh, it's like a yeah. 200 to me. It's absolutely yes. fabulous. No more two. The dress itself is one thing. It's beautiful. It's stunning. It's a statement. But when I turn around and they've put the veil on. Bailey, would you like to open your eyes? Yes. <laughs> oh my God. Wow. wow. This. Beautiful. Ah, uh, I die. Yeah, I'm emotional. This is a lot. Beautiful I've ever felt. To finally have found that dress and feel like this is happening, it takes a lot of the pressure off. So I have a question. Are you glad that Swaggy didn't see this? I am glad that Swaggy didn't see this. We made the right decision. I want him to be stunned on the day. Yeah. So I think this was the best choice to make. Yeah. So should we ask the question? Yes. Yeah. Are you ready? I'm ready. Bailey, yes. are, are you, you saying, saying yes, yes to the dress? Yes. I love it. I love it. Wow. Love Thank it. you. You're gonna love it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be perfect. You're gonna like, you're gonna melt. I'm definitely excited. I think the marriage is the most important part and that's all that I'm looking forward to.